close again. There appears to be one mod that keeps breaking my game. I don't know why, but it keeps breaking my game. So I'm not going to talk to this person yet. Hey, Comet. Did you want to talk? Need some. What's up? Wildlands. Oh, okay. Yes. I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Right, Let's here see here. I have a letter here for you. I just thought it was Looks a, like that's it. Got to go. A little scary, I Riches I beyond imagining. I found these words inscribed in ancient dwarven ruins in the Reach. I believe I they mark the entrance to a forgotten it, so. city. My brother went in a and few the days ago and is, hasn't returned. One cute crashing. I need someone I can count on to go in after him and I'm trying to figure out which alive. mod is breaking the game. I've heard great things about you, which is why I'm asking for your help. I'll be waiting for you in the ruins. Please hurry. And remember, riches beyond imagining. Cassia. Well, I... I... I'm pretty sure it's one of the body mods. Hello, friend. No. I mean, I, I have. I I have three, but it's all they're all compatible. Each, it's the same. It's variations of the. It's a. It's an upgrade of the. Of the yeah, same Arthur. Yeah. But I know what the problem is, is uh, Xbox has it built in that if it's, if it, if it causes nudity, it freezes the, the game. The sooner our lives can get back to normal. You're back from Bleak Falls. So the Did only thing I have to do, I, I cannot strip uh, females. I can wear skimpy armor, but I cannot take armor off of females because uh, whatever the mod is, um, it leaves the panties on, but it, it, it they're topless. So it doesn't like that. You found it. <laughs> there it is. Strange. It seems smaller than I remember. <laughs> Funny thing, huh? I'm gonna put this back where it belongs. I'll, I'll never forget this. You've done a great thing for me and my sister. Well, they don't. I mean, you can, because there's games that have it built in and they don't have care with it. Thank you so much for taking care of those thieves. The Riverwood Trader is- The guards yeah. in Skyrim are a miserable bunch. We risk life and limb slaying wolves, bandits, and a lot worse all day. You and, and they me. complain We're about the a single arrow in the knee. Ah, good to see you. Okay, so. And I've got one mod I need to check. I can't check it right now. I need to wait. I mean, because I, I did check it, and I, mean, I did add the follower, and the game froze when I got outside. But I think that was uh, for 
the fact that cur a courier was supposed to show up and, and it froze on the courier trying to show up. Huh? Because the, the, the follower mod is nothing. chat talking with a friend of mine so you'll hear me randomly talking about things you don't understand <laughs> I will port this over to uh, YouTube later oh yeah comma I have a YouTube channel now I uh, Oh wait, I don't want to ride my horse yet. I want to go over here. Here for work. Get an axe and bring me all the wood you can chop. I added the camping mod in, so so I need to make a tent. Yep. Oh, I don't have enough leather. I'm gonna have to buy enough leather. Uh, I will make a large leather tent. I will make uh, it a two with two bed rolls since there's two of us. No, I don't mean that kind of adult. It makes you think, though. Uh, we'll make a backpack for my follower. Did you want something? Yippee! I love holding people's junk. Yeah, there's the one of the mods is one of the body mods is uh, uses a nude base, and therefore they the original mod didn't. But they. Uh, for some reason, when I reset my Xbox a while back, I got, I hadn't played this since April. And I jumped on, and all my mods were just, were, were no longer loaded in. I had to download, re-download all my mods. Let's not hang around then. So I had no... And a lot of the mods I had before are no longer available. I feel like all my saves have, I'm having to redo. I actually had one I had to uh, completely delete because uh, um, I loaded into it and the character had no head. The invisible, or I was, my body was invisible, I guess. Is, is, is what it's is. good to see you again. Take a look. Let's see what he's got for sale. I'll buy the iron ignit. I'll buy the leather. I'll buy the strips. I'll buy the steel ignits. And is there any apparel I need? Frost resistance, I'll buy that to break it down. I 
right. Let's go back over to the tanning rack. We'll buy it. And we'll make a small leather tent for when I'm solo. Yeah, that's kind of loud. Good to see you. Okay, let's see what we have here. Go ahead and enhance this. Skyrim might be a cold place with miserable people, but after a few drinks, you don't really notice. Now we need to go to White Run and inform uh, the Jarl that the dragon attacked Helgen. Before we do that, I just remembered I need to find an axe and make some firewood. Do I have an axe? I do not. Well, I can get an axe in White Run. Try to come back and get this follower later. Nope. Sorry. Nothing. Yeah, come up my YouTube channel right now. I have two Skyrim videos and four Neverwinter videos on it. I had a Talion on Neverwinter uh, doing the Elemental Evil campaign. As soon as I get my VIP back, I will finish the element on it. I've got four parts on it to it right now, so I got the last part of it to do. Well, eventually I will need for the new for the new campaign stuff. I will. Current the element of metal evil I down. That one's rather easy, especially since I'm doing it on Taliana.
what I need to do is figure out a way to uh, stream from my PC while I'm on the Xbox. Now I've got to get a I've got to get a cable that connect you know that connects the PC to the uh, Xbox and then. Yeah, I'm streaming on Twitch and then porting over to YouTube afterwards. But I gotta keep the videos fairly short. Otherwise it takes forever for it to, to export. Port. City's closed with the dragons about. Official business only. But we'll be keeping an eye on you. Yeah, one of the elemental campaigns is over a four hour video and it took it like two and a half hours to export. <laughs> And for those of you tank viewers that are that join in, I will be streaming tanks also still. can I do for you? I, that I do. I've got to, if I hope to be as good as Yorland Greymane someday. In fact, I just finished my best piece of work. It's a sword. I made it for the Jarl, Balgruf the Greater. It's a surprise. I don't even know if he'll accept it, but... Listen, could you take the sword to my father, Proventus Avenici? He's the Jarl steward. He'll know the right time to present it to him. Thanks. Hmm, blades, helmets, pretty much anything to suit your needs. Uh, nothing I want. Weapons? all we can afford. We need to save our gold. Good luck out there. <laughs> oh, did you need something? I did download Tales for the Borderlands since it was a free game this month. But we can't afford it. It took me weeks to find that game. I can't stop now, but I can't get the sword on my own. Businesses, your children, your very life. Wait, you played Borderlands though, didn't you? No, never did. I don't do zombies. So.
is true. Well, there's no telling what it means. My lord, please. You have what to listen. What would you have me do then? Nothing? What's the meaning of this interruption? My lord. Jarl Balgoth is not so receiving visitors. I just think we need more information before we act. I just Well, that explains why the guards let Who you in. This, then? Come on then. The Jarl will want to speak to you personally. So, you were at Helgen. You saw this dragon with your own eyes? By Ismir, Irileth was right. What do you say now, Proventus? Shall we continue to trust in the strength of our walls against the dragon? My lord, we should send troops to Riverwood at once. It's in the most immediate danger. If that dragon is lurking in the mountains... The Jarl of Falkreath will view that as a provocation. He'll assume we're preparing to join Ulfric's side and attack him. We should Enough. not... I'll not stand idly by while the dragon burns my hold and slaughters my people. Irilet, send a detachment to Riverwood at once. Yes, my Jarl. If you'll excuse me, I'll return to my duties. That would be best. Well done. You sought me out on your own initiative. You've done White Run a service, and I won't forget it. Here, take this as a small token of my esteem. There is another thing you could do for me. Suitable for someone of your particular talents, perhaps. Come, let's go find Faringar, my court wizard. He's been looking into a matter related to these dragons and rumors of dragons. Mm -hmm. I served. The Jarl is, as you can imagine, very busy. From Adrian? Ah, this must be that weapon for the Jarl. Poor girl. So eager to prove herself. I'll present it to Balgruff when his mood is agreeable. Thank you. Please, take these few coins, for services rendered. Enjoy your visit to Dragon's Reach. We need gold, not very much, for delivering a sword. Faringar, I think I've found someone who can help you with your dragon project. Go ahead and fill her in with all the details. So the Earl thinks you can be of use to me. Oh yes, he must be referring to my research into the dragons. Yes, I could use someone to fetch something for me. Well, when I say fetch, I really mean delve into a dangerous ruin in search of an ancient stone tablet that may or may not actually be there. Straight to the point, eh? No need for tedious hows and whys. I like that. Leave those details to your betters, am I right? I, uh, learned of a certain stone tablet said to be housed in Bleak Falls Barrow. A dragon stone, said to contain a map of dragon burial sites. Go to Bleak Falls Barrow, find this tablet, no doubt interred in the main chamber, and bring it to me. Simplicity itself. Ah! The Dragon Stone of Bleak Falls Barrow. You already found it. You are cut from a different cloth than the usual brutes the Jarl foists on me. You'll have to see the Jarl about that. Maybe his steward, Avenici. I'm sure one of them will pay you appropriately. Alright, so we gave him that. Good to see. Divines bless you. 
May the ground you walk quake as you pass. Enjoy your visit to Dragon's Reach. Stop it. What can I do for you? Let's go. Now we'll go talk to the Jarl again. So, Yurileth tells me you came from the Western Watchtower? Yes, my lord. Tell him what you told me about the dragon. Oh, that's right. We saw it coming from the south. It was fast. Faster than anything I've ever seen. What did it do? Is it attacking the watchtower? No, my lord. It was just circling overhead when I left. I never ran so fast. Now you're to follow me on Twitch, Comet. <clears throat> come after me, for sure. Good work, son. We'll take it from here. Head down to the barracks for some food and rest. You've earned it. Irleth. You better gather some guardsmen and get down there. I've already ordered my men to muster near the main gate. <laughs> Good. Don't fail me. There's no time to stand on ceremony, my friend. I need your help again. I want you to go with Irileth and help her fight this dragon. You survived Helgen, so you have more experience with dragons than anyone else here. But I haven't forgotten the service you did for me in retrieving the dragon stone for Faringar. As a token of my esteem, I have instructed Avenici that you are now permitted to purchase property in the city. And please, accept this gift from my personal armory. I should come along. I would very much like to see this dragon. No, I can't afford to risk both of you. I need you here working on ways to defend the city against these dragons. As you command. One last thing, Irileth. This isn't a death or glory mission. I need to know what we're dealing with. Don't worry, my lord. I'm the very soul of caution. Let's see how much, uh... Now, where is this dude? Where is that guy? I'm gonna run back up here real quick. Oh, there he is. Good to see you. Splendid. There's a house available right now. Wonderful. Here's the key to your new home. Okay, now I have a house. Enjoy your visit to Dragon's Reach. Well, I have a house inside of a... Um, whatever the town this is. Uh, White Run. time took went by
five septums right now, or I'm gonna bloody your nose. No, please. I really don't have any money, Bray. I'll give you ten septums tomorrow. Just don't hit me. Ten septums. Well, we missed the speech she was giving them. They say Helgen got hit by a dragon. Hello, friend. Never work on a farm. They are always full of We'll leave our horses here. No reason for them to get killed by a dragon. Never again will I do an honest day's work. I know it looks bad, but we've got to figure out what happened. If that dragon is still skulking around somewhere. Spread out, and look for survivors. We need to know what to do. Get back. It's still here somewhere. Corky and Tor just got grabbed when they tried to make a run for it. God, what happened here? Where's this dragon? Quickly now! I don't know. Keep them save us. Here he comes again. Here he comes. Find cover and make every arrow count.
believe it. You are dragonborn. In the very oldest tales, back from when there were still dragons in Skyrim, the dragonborn would slay dragons and steal their power. That's what you did, isn't it? Absorb the dragon's power. There's only one way to find out. Try to shout. That would prove it. According to the old legends, only the dragonborn can shout without training, the way the dragons do. Dragonborn? What are you talking about? Power alone! The voice of the dragonborn. I've I can't believe it. You actually dragons. killed a dragon. And you there absorbed its soul? Then, this day They're just keeps getting better. The first time in just wait forever. till I tell people that a true hero slayed a dragon. Of course you helped out a bit. <laughs> I'm only joking. You say Although you couldn't have done it without me. Come on here now. Tell us. Do you believe in this dragonborn business? <laughs> Some of you would be better off keeping quiet. Wait, are you really dragonborn? So I guess that really does make you kind of special. I guess you almost live up to my high standards now. Good looking, strong, brave, adventurous. So tell me what sort of women are you into? <laughs> Not that I'm interested in you or anything. You ain't at all. I went all across Tamriel. I've seen plenty of things just as outlandish as I'd advise you all to trust in the strength of your sword arm over tales and legends. That was shouting, what you just did. Must be. You really are I'm taking dragonborn. command here for the moment. You head back to Whiterun and let the Jarl know what happened. Alright, so we will head back to Whiterun. be doing this at night but oh well
Have you ever read the lusty Argonian maid? It sounds like my kind of book. What? Just because I'm female doesn't mean I can't enjoy a nice classy piece of literature? I've heard it's quite intellectually stimulating. Actually, I just heard it was stimulating. Although I don't think it was the intellectual kind. Report to the Arles. You're finally here. The Jarl's been waiting for you. You heard the summons. What else could it mean? The Greybeards. We were just talking about you. My brother needs a word with you. So what happened at the Watchtower? Was the dragon there? I knew I could count on Irileth. But there must be more to it than that. So it's true. The Grey Beards really were summoning you. Masters of the Way of the Voice. They live in seclusion high on the slopes of the throat of the world. The Dragonborn is said to be uniquely gifted in the Voice. The ability to focus your vital essence into a doom or shout. If you really are Dragonborn, they can teach you how to use your gift. Didn't you hear the thundering sound as you returned to Whiterun? That was the voice of the Greybeards, summoning you to High Rothgar. This hasn't happened in centuries, at least. Not since Tiber Septim himself was summoned mm. when he was still Talos of Atmora. Rangar, calm yourself. What does any of this Nord nonsense have to do with our friend here? All this walking Capable as she may front be, wedgie. I don't see any signs of her being I this... I said it out loud, didn't I? ...dragonborn. Nord nonsense? Why, you puffed up ignorant. These are our sacred traditions that go back to the founding of the First Empire. Rangar, don't be so hard on Avenici. I meant no disrespect, of course. It's just that... What do these Greybeards want with her? That's the Greybeards' business, not ours. Whatever happened when you killed that dragon, it revealed something in you, and the Greybeards heard it. If they think you're dragonborn, who are we to argue? You'd better get up to High Hrothgar immediately. There is no refusing the summons of the Greybeards. It's a tremendous honor. I envy you, you know, to climb the 7,000 steps again. I made the pilgrimage once. Did you know that? High Hrothgar is a very peaceful place. Very disconnected from the troubles of this world. I wonder that the Greybeards even notice what's going on down here. They haven't seemed to care before. <sighs> no matter. Go to High Hrothgar. Learn what the Greybeards can teach you. You've done a great service for me and my city, Dragonborn. By my right as Jarl, I name you Thane of Whiterun. 
It's the greatest honor that's within my power to grant. I assign you Lydia as a personal housecarl, and this weapon from my armory to serve as your badge of office. I'll also notify my guards of your new title. Wouldn't want them to think you're part of the common rabble, now would we? We are honored to have you as Thane of our city, Dragonborn. Well, well, look who it is. How have you been? They're the masters of the way of the voice. Of shouting. They live up on top of the throat of the world. If you're really Dragonborn, They'll want to talk to you. In the old stories, they always summon the Dragonborn for training. Keep safe. So you're Thano, huh? Well, don't think some fancy title is going to make me your servant. Although I must admit I'm happy for you. Perhaps I could take advantage of you sometime. Uh, I mean, if we got into trouble, I could use your status to my advantage. The Jarl has appointed me to be your house, Carl. It's an honor to serve you. As my Thane, I'm sworn to your service. I'll guard you and all you own with my life. The Jarl has recognized you as a person of great importance in the Hold, a hero. The title of Thane is an honor, a gift for your service. Guards will know to look the other way if you tell them who you are. Oh, hey there. Lead the way. Oh, my What's the deal with that house call the Yal just gave you? She doesn't look much to me. I could outmatch her in terms of combat, looks, and just about anything, really. I don't know what you could possibly see in her. I'm going to turn off that no idle animations. Somebody fell in the water. Apparently, it was Lydia who fell in the water.
it doesn't have much, but it does have a bed. something to say why would you ever not need me I'm glad that's sorted Right behind you. Mm. So she's a one handed uh, heavy armor. I'll guard you with my life. All right, let's see how much money we have. I've got 3,300 gold. Yes. Have you seen that woman selling food at the market stall? Apparently, all the men in white run fancy her. She wishes. Divines bless you. May the ground you walk quake as you pass. 
I'll be glad to help you. There are many ways to improve your home, provided you have the coin. And of course, don't forget to consult your home decorating guide for descriptions of the decorations you can buy. Now, what would you like to purchase? Very well. I'll make the arrangements. The next time you visit your house, your new furnishings will be in place. Is there anything else you'd like to purchase? Very well. I'll make the arrangements. The next time you visit your house, your new furnishings will be in place. Is there anything else you'd like to purchase? Very well. I'll make the arrangements. The next time you visit your house, your new furnishings will be in place. Is there anything else you'd like to purchase? Very well. I'll make the arrangements. The next time you visit your house, your new furnishings will be in place. Is there anything else you'd like to purchase? Very well. I'll make the arrangements. The next time you visit your house, your new furnishings will be in place. Is there anything else you'd like to purchase? As you wish, speak to me again if you decide to purchase some decorations for your home. Enjoy your visit to Dragon's Reach. No, oh, I need to level up. I keep forgetting that. Let's see how much money we have. We still have enough. Actually, we need to go use that enchanters. We need to use that. <clears throat> we need to disenchant some things so we can learn the ability. <laughs>
That's how it's done. I doubt anyone in Skyrim could have weaved a better enchantment. Out of all the Daedric princes, Sanguine is the only one I would actually consider worshipping. He really understands how to have a good time and knows the importance of alcohol. I quite like Shield Gorath too.
Mm. Well, we need some money, so let's talk to Come him. Come to Dragon's Reach to discuss the ongoing hostilities, like the rest of the great warriors. Take a look. He doesn't have a lot of gold, but he's got a little bit of gold. I can, I can sell off some of this stuff. Got the aptitude. You should join the Mages College in Winterhold.
57. Slow process getting this done, I know. Okay, it's not going to be a difference right now. Yes, I'm going to quit enchanting. All right. I bet if a guy found out his wife was dragonborn, he wouldn't be best pleased. Next Spells and incantations for those with the talent to guess. No value whatsoever, really? The aptitude, woman you should join the husband? Major's College in Winterhold. <laughs> that would really give him something to complain about. All right, we need to go to the store. She's up armor, so she's more into light armor.
yes. Welcome to Bellathor's General Goods. Welcome indeed. Ah, good to see you. Take a look. Well, they don't work very much, but we'll we'll sell them. Actually, let's just pretty much sell all this stuff for now. We'll get more later. Let's see what he's got for sale. Oh, they have uh, those have re. Trinkets, odds and ends, that sort of thing. Let's see what he's got in the miscellaneous department. Well, he wants a lot for those. We'll buy the goat hide, though. We'll buy the goat horns. One of the straw. Interesting, to say the least. What with all that's been going on. On the one hand, supplies are harder to come by since fewer traders are traveling the roads these days. But on the other, the scarcity of supplies has led to some, well, elevated prices. All that matters is that I have what you need, and it's worth every septum. It was a pleasure. All right, it's time to put on... I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Let's see here. Looks like that's it. Got to go. Another copy of her play. 
I'd like to help her out, but not right now. All right, let's chop up some firewood. That pompous red guard who wanders around White Run boasting. If he mentions the Cloud District one more time, then I'm going to get one of the vegetables from his farm and ram them up his. Sorry, I was going off on a rant again, wasn't I? most power out of your shot. And we'll see what my house looks like now. <sighs> yeah, I'm gonna have to try that. Uh, no more idle animations. Still here. Let's get going then.
We need more drunk people in Skyrim. That would make things ten times more fun. I mean... Why would the guards discourage drunken behavior? When they should be encouraging it. A drunken person is a happy person. There we go. Put it in there. And those doors are closed for now. Yeah, I don't like that at all. What time is it? 6.43 p.m. We don't want to want to start in the morning, so we're not going to go anywhere now. There's my house, Carl's bed.
All right, we're going to save there. And I'm going to call it. And I'm going to call it there. Uh, it looks like a stream on Twitch. So if you like these, uh, follow me on Twitch. If you like the video, hit the like or subscribe on YouTube. And I will do. Um, I'll try doing this one. I'll try to do one, maybe two of these episodes a week. I'm not sure. <clears throat> Appreciate everyone for watching, and we will see you next time.